Well, we are in the control room of my brand new studio that I have aptly named Rhythm and Soul Recording. Um, this is our control room in our brand new space. It's an 1100 square foot space. And uh, we have this amazing control room that was designed by Kevin Lee Hughes and Jason Spence. When we, we've always had, when I say we, my wife and I have always had the dream of having a great studio here. My wife's a concert violinist actually. And we've always had the dream of having a recording studio in this space. We bought this house for the sole purpose of doing that. And um, so in 2018, we started clearing everything out. It took um, about five years for us to really see this thing through um, from cleaning out the space to going through the design process. And, you know, look, there were a lot of growing pains through that whole process, just trying to figure out what what we ran into. Uh, fortunately, nothing like termites or anything like that. Everything was structurally sound, but making the choices and the decisions that we made to build the space. Um, and this control room uh, is just sounds absolutely amazing. And considering two novice guys built it just by following the plans, we were able to put this together. It was pretty incredible. This space here is, as I mentioned, is the control room with these awesome red speakers that sound amazing. But the thing is about this room and the layers and with the, you know, it's not unusual when you're building a studio like this that you put in double drywall and that sort of thing. And, and so we went through that process and the green glue process and that sort of thing. And then in the back wall, we've got a bass trap um, with layers back there. And the, the, the remarkable thing about this room um, and the way it's turned out with all the cloth. We don't have reflective surfaces in here. We stained the concrete floor, so we avoided any sort of hardwood issues, any gaps, anything like that. Made a huge difference for us. And we knew the room was gonna sound good, but I had no idea it was gonna sound this good. Um, once we got this furniture in here that, that Kevin's company put together for us, uh, and then got the speakers in here, which is our newest addition. Uh, tuned the room a little bit. Um, it just, it's remarkable. And everybody who literally sits in the back and listens to these speakers starts to laugh uncontrollably because they sound so amazing. This is one of several rooms. We've got a lounge, a nice size lounge in the front with the kitchen. We've got a great sounding isolation booth. It's just remarkable. Uh, I have a vocal area for scratch vocals and that sort of thing. And then the coup de gras is the room you see behind you hopefully, uh, is the drum room with the cedar. It's this, what we call the cedar room. And, uh, or the red room is what I love to call it because red is my favorite color. And um, uh, it, this whole space is remarkable. And we can track up to eight players. We're running Dante uh, through the whole thing. So it's networked um, with Dante. I've got a matching, uh, a, I've got a control space in next to the drum kit. Um, where I have all my mic pre's, so I can dial in my drums there. I've got, it, it's a mirror image of what you would see in this computer screen here. Um, so I can run an entire session myself in there, or I can have an engineer, engineer in here do it. When I track in there, then I can come in here and do any editing I need to. Uh, we track, we can track eight players uh, throughout the space, and we've done that, and it's very comfortable actually. Um, it sounds remarkably good.